So I'm going to look into the fixed wing mode for the Mavic. Um, it's just been released in the latest firmware. Um, it's a little bit different to the other modes. To access it, you have to go and enable it in the remote control settings. I'll show you that on the app before I fly. Um, and then if you've done any remote control plane flying, then you understand it completely. It's pretty obvious. Um, but if you haven't, then uh, like a plane, it's always moving forward. So that's the first thing you need to do um, to activate this mode is fly forward. Um, you have to get to a minimum speed. Once you get to that speed, you click the C1 button on the back of the remote control, and then it's going to um, activate the fixed wing mode and keep the, the Mavic in that um, forward motion at that same speed. So it's artificially going to look like it is going to be banking like an aircraft, so left and right, and when it's um, ascending and descending, uh, you'll see that the camera tilts, so it looks like you're going up and down Pretty much it looks like you're flying an aircraft. Um, okay. I'm guessing this is for the, the goggles that are going to be coming out. Uh, it will be pretty fun when you've got that um, for first person view. Um, you want to have a nice uh, open area for the first time you want to do it. Uh, you can also do it in sport mode so you can get a bit of speed and then activate it. So I deactivate the avoidance collision, the, the, the sensors. Um, this is because uh, I was flying a bit low at one stage and they activated um, and there was a tree quite a fair way in the distance and it stopped the fixed wing mode so I turn it off because uh, I feel like I'm confident enough to just fly around and I don't need the um, avoidance collision um, only do that if you know where you're flying and all the obstacles and all that kind of stuff um, it just happens then that it won't kick out of the um, fixed wing mode it'll still fly um, you'll get a beep to tell you that there's a, an obstacle but uh, you just don't need to worry about it um, unlike all the other modes and you come on the left here and you go into them here uh, this is a little bit different, you need to go to the three dots up the top here, to the settings um, and the remote control settings, and then you can see there configure fixed wing mode. So I've, I've enabled it at the moment, so you just slide this and it's enabled. Uh, and then use the C1 and C2 buttons uh, on the back of the controller. C1 is the left hand button and C2 is the right button. Take off. So I've deactivated um, the avoidance collision, that's what that was. I've done that because it affects you when you're flying fixed wing mode if you're a bit lower and there's obstacles around. So you just need to make sure the Mavic's going forward a bit. Uh, once the little icon on the left pops up, so you can see there, press the C1 button. And have no fingers on any sticks, it is just going at 13.3 k's uh, in that forward motion. Now I'm just using the one stick now to do a left turn. And then I'm going to level it out. So, so say I want to climb. I'm going to climb. And then I'm going to do a left hand turn. And you can see it kind of banks like a plane. Um, so you'll be able to see that in your footage. Okay, so I'm going to bank around to the left again. Just keep banking around. and level out. So say I climb again, see how it looks like you're climbing as in if you're climbing in a plane. Okay, I'm going to do a left hand turn now and I'm going to descend. And there you go, it looks like I'm descending and doing a dive. Okay, but all that is is artificial with the um, gimbal. I'm going to level that out and do a left hand bank, left hand turn. Okay, keep banking around, and I'm going to level out. Um, so, so I'm going to increase the speed, I'm going to put more throttle on, and you'll see that the speed increases. Okay, and say so I release it, it's going to come back to the speed that I set with the C1. So it's coming back to about 13 k's. And I'm going to increase the speed to full. And you'll see speed is increasing. It's nearly at 20 k's. Okay. So, and stop there. Okay, I'm going to do a right hand turn. 
So that's full right. It's a full bank turn. And I'm going to level out there. And do another full right bank turn. And level out there. And again, come around to the left. Full turn. So I'm going to press the C2 button and it's going to exit the mode and then it just hovers, okay? Now you can do this in sport mode also, so I'm going to change it to sport mode. Um, and yeah, we'll try in sport mode, so I'm going to give it a bit of power. Press the C1. Okay, so it's going a bit faster now. So now you want to know what you're really doing. Okay, so I'm in sport mode now. Uh, I'm getting a bit more speed now. As you can see. So, I'll do a dive down. And a left hand bank. And a climb. Level out. Level out. Left hand turn. So as you can see, you kind of want a bit of space to be doing this. Especially if you're in sport mode, okay? It happens quite fast. So what happened there is that uh, that tree activated its braking and it exited the mode because it thought that I was getting too close to it. Um, I was actually watching the Mavic then because I knew the tree was there and I was quite a fair way off it. Um, so that's the only downside on the uh, avoidance collision is that it will exit the modes um, if you get too close to them. Um, yeah, so it's all good. I'm just going to put it back into the normal mode. Um, I'm just going to fly around a bit slower and I'll just do a bit more um, turning. So I activate the C1, so it's activated and come around to the left, so that's full bank left. So one thing to notice is that you cannot use uh, the tilt of your camera now. Um, okay, so that is locked, you cannot use it. So I'm going to increase the throttle. So it flies pretty nice. It's just flying like a remote control plane. Uh, FPV, there's a hawk. Oh, don't want to hit that. That was pretty close. Where is that hawk? I'll go see if I can find it. It's going over the maze. It wasn't worried about it, was it? I've actually lost a uh, drone from a bird strike. Um, a bird dove at it and it took it out of the sky. Um, this was in the Philippines. Uh, so there it kind of... Uh, activated the avoidance there from that tree so it kind of it, you can't get too close to objects otherwise it kind of starts to uh, jilter around and um,
So again, that was from a tree. Okay. And I'll level out there. So now I'm actually higher than all the trees around, so that shouldn't really affect um, me too much anymore. Full bank turn. <laughs> 